know that God believes and trusts in us. Yes, yes. That we are not cursed and condemned no. and born in sin, but that Allah created us upright. Yes. And that he trusts that even in this difficult time, yes, that even in times of desperation, yes. even in times when it looks dark and belief and bleak, that Allah trusts that we will push up through the oppression. Yeah. We will push up yeah. through the darkness yeah. and walk in the light. And that would be our message to any Muslim. Whether they're in Israel or not. Yeah. Other than they Hitler. All right. Who are brutalizing those people to know it. That what they must have is to determine faith and trust in God. Allah way, That's right. Because He is the designer and the fastener. Right. He knows the beginning and the end. That's right. And if you hold that faith, no matter how bad, how many tanks and helicopters, and how much support that they have from the media, that the believers will win through. Doesn't Allah say that? Yeah. Not if I have to know. That's right. That the believers will win through. That's right. Many of our people were believers in America. But we were subjected to horrible treatment. That's right. We were outcasts. Mm -hmm. We were enslaved and brutalized. We were stripped of our language and our culture, cut off from true religion. That's right. We were thrown in the mud of civilization, knocked off the throne of civilization, stripped of Islam, stripped of our religion, our name, our culture, made to worship a false god. Mm -hmm. But even though that peculiar system of slavery looked like it had no end, hundreds of years, mm -hmm. but another hundred years of Jim Crow lynching and blue beating, it looks like no end in sight. But Almighty Allah in His own time caused good people to rise up and to help to free us from chattel slavery. But it did more than that. Then we allowed over time, over time, for this Quran, for Islam, to come find itself in the slums, in the slums of America, to find it among in the belly of the beast. Now the prophet is a witness, and we are a witness. So, are we not a witness for the Palestinians and anyone else that is being oppressed? And God is real. He's more of your savior. 
from the nation of Islam teaching yes. into universal Islam. Yes. And that is a mighty and powerful phenomenon. Yes. A great work that has been done not only in America, but in the world. Yes. We are a blessed and fortunate people. Yes. We are a noble and a great people because Almighty Allah made us great. He took us to the bottom of this pit in the belly of the beast. And like Jonah, in the belly of the well, we pray for God to deliver us, and we have been delivered. We can do more, but we have been delivered. And we should tell our children, our babies, to tell their babies and their babies of this great work in America. And the future is 